Hi there, welcome back to the next video and in this video I will talk about how you can create a histogram within Plotly, what is the syntax and how you can create it and we will create directly two histograms so that we can see that if we need to create multiple histogram how we can create it. So if you remember from my previous video I have talked about um, this data set, the sales orders data set which is basically this so we were going to or I'm going to use the same one and uh, so what I need is basically two different uh, traces so what I'm going to choose is sales and profit like uh, sales and profit it has been cho chosen earlier because that's easy to understand so let's create the traces so we will call it trace zero is go dot histogram. So go is nothing but the library we imported it earlier. The uh, of objects of uh, plotly um, go dot histogram, uh, and within that we need to specify parameters. And since it is histogram, you just need to specify x parameter. X is equals to orders dot sales and give it a name so that you can identify or clearly by looking at the legend and you can specify opacity is equals to let's say 0.5 so we'll just go ahead and copy that and paste it here order dot sales now we will call it order dot profit and we will change it to profit so what we are doing here is creating two histogram sales histogram and profit histogram just to see their distribution and once we are here we will create a data which is uh, trace zero trace one and uh, we will create layout go dot layout just give the title sales versus profit distribution all right and uh, now we need to create a figure so go dot figure data is data layout parameter is layout now we will plot it using pyo dot plot and fig all right so if you see this is what the distribution of uh, sales and profit and if you want to analyze it properly let's say only this section you can slice it and that's where your profit and distribution is and uh, here you can find the legend Oops. so blue is indicated by sales profit is indicated by orange and uh, then you can do your data analysis based on your needs so that's how you can see very easily by creating two traces three traces four traces based on how many comparison you want and how much complexity you want you can just go ahead and create it and put it in data and layout and create the figure so that's about it um, how you can create histogram and uh, if you like this video then go ahead and hit the like button and to get all of these videos directly in your inbox subscribe to this channel so that's pretty much it and I will meet you in the new video, a new topic.